Hello friends, welcome to Middle Life 7 YouTube channel. This video is about ELISA test that means enzyme link immunosorbent assay. It detects and measures antigens and antibody in your blood. There are different types of ELISA test. Those are direct ELISA, indirect ELISA, competitive ELISA and sandwich ELISA. I am going to tell you briefly about how is a sandwich ELISA performed. In here, antigen is coated onto wells by passive adsorption. Then we add patient serum sample which contains antibody and it will bind with antigen. Finally, enzyme labeled antigen and substrate are added. Enzyme reaction occurs and color of the solution will change. It is one of the most efficient laboratory tests to detect the concentration of a target antigen or antibody in a completely unknown sample. So let's see how to perform sandwich ELISA test to detect antibody concentration of the patient sample. Regents and Equipments ELISA Reader ELISA Washer Pipette Multi-Channel or Single Channel Incubator Regents Kit Contain Sample Wells Before going to the ELISA procedure, you have to know about the procedure will vary for every test parameter and manufacturer. The procedure to be followed should be based on the manufacturer instruction and should be validated before being put in use for the patient sample. ELISA Procedure Allow the reagents in kit to reach room temperature. Plate is coated with the suitable capture antigen. Then serum sample should be added to wells of the mitrotator plate. Sample contains antibodies. Add conjugate reagent in the each wells. Then cover the plate with the plate sealer and incubate the plate for 1 hour at 37 Celsius. After incubation, remove and discard the plate sealer. Watch each well 5 times with diluted wash buffer. After the final washing cycle, turn the strips plate on the blotting paper and tap the plate to remove any remainders. Coloring that means substrate. Dispense chromogen A and chromogen B solution into each well. Cover the plate with plate sealer and mix gently by tapping the plate.
Incubate the plate at 37 Celsius for 15 minutes. Avoiding light. In here, enzyme substrate reaction will take place. Stopping reaction. Remove and discard the plate sealer. Using pipette, add stop solution into each well. Mix gently. The blue color will turn yellow after stopping the reaction. Finally, measure the absorbances using ELISA reader.